Hello everyone and welcome back for another video. It has been a little over a week since my last posting here on YouTube. Um, got really busy with Christmas and wrapping up the year at work that um, time kind of slipped away from me. I never really got to um, issue a Merry Christmas video. Um, I'm probably going to do a separate video coming up soon that shows some of my Christmas um, gifts for you all to see. So that'll kind of be my more official Merry Christmas slash Happy New Year video to you all. But um, thank you to everybody that's been subscribing so far um, these last couple of months. I really appreciate it. I've gone over 200 subscribers finally. It's been a slow, slow road, but I finally got there. And, um, you know, I appreciate everybody that, that views. I've got some, some loyal folks that are always commenting and you know, giving me great feedback. So I appreciate those folks. You all know who you are and um, can't wait to, to jump back into this uh, coming up into 2022. This is a video that I've uh, wanted to do for a long time. However, I didn't have the physical format of this. So now that I finally have it, I can finally do this video. Um, this is a video. It's going to be an unboxing for two pieces of, um, of media that I just received in the mail just before Christmas. This is the new album by the Wild Feathers called Alvarado. And I received the CD as well as the record in the mail. I ordered it way back, I guess in June, when it was announced that they had a new album coming out. The album came out in October and I didn't get it until uh, a week before Christmas. Um, record supply is unbelievable and um, I wasn't able to get one piece without the other. They were mailing them together. So even though the CD was ready, um, I couldn't get it because it was with my record. Those are the days that we live in. But this is the latest album by one of my favorite modern groups, The Wild Feathers. I've talked about them before. I have a a much older video where I kind of do a tribute to them. Um, I think I might post that in the description because I don't think I got the love that it needed. Um, this is a great American band out of Nashville, Tennessee. Um, five guys that know their stuff. Um, you have Taylor Burns, Joel King, Ricky Young um, as the three main um, songwriters slash singers. They're all from different bands and kind of came together about 10 years ago or so and put out their debut self-titled album, The Wild Feathers. And I've just been killing it on so many levels. I love them to death. They're like Tom Petty met the band, met um, a little bit of Southern rock with some just crunchy guitars, um, Great harmonies, the Eagles definitely are, are in there too. But anyway, that's another video. I've done it before. I'll um, try to remember to link it below. But what I want to do is I want to go ahead and unbox um, the CD and the record for you all. And let's just see what we have here. Um, and I'm sure this is old news to those of you that actually know the Wild Feathers. So I apologize for that. But I also like to give them... Um, credit when I see that there's an opportunity to and um, with this new album which I haven't heard yet I've been waiting to listen to the CD so I'm excited to listen to the record um, so I'll let you um, listen to that on your own time and there's no hype sticker or anything so I'm just gonna tear into the CD here and this oh gosh static and um, I'm going to do the same thing with the, the record as well. So again, it's Alvarado. Um, well, when I first looked, the picture on the back and on the front is glossed. And so that's kind of neat while everything else is kind of matted. And um, there's the gatefold of the CD with the boys hanging out. Um, and credits, um, of course, the other two members, I've um, failed to mention them, Brett Moore and Ben Dumas. 
And let's see. And of course, they're all original songs. Uh, there's all sorts of um, credits on here, that sort of thing. Uh, their thank yous to their wives and management and all that good stuff. And then you just have the standard black CD uh, label. And it doesn't look like there's a booklet or anything in here. And again, this is also glossy as well. So um, there's the CD version of Alvarado. Check it out. It's on their website. And I also failed to mention, this is the first record that the boys have done on New West Records, which is one of my favorite record labels. They also have um, The Wallflowers with Jacob Dylan are on New West. Um, Pokey Lafarge, I've talked about him before. He's on New West, so it's a killer record label. Now here's the, um, the album. There's no hype sticker and it's a gatefold, so I'm not even going to worry about saving the shrink because I won't be able to get into the record. So here we go. I'm just going to tear right into it here. And there's a reason that I saved the vinyl as the second thing I would unwrap here. And once again, much better um, the album work there. You can see it's kind of glossy. I'm not sure how well it comes across. And glossy there. Really pretty. And my guess is that it's the same. Yep. It's the same gatefold in here. But really nice to see that full picture with the credits um, over here. And see the boys having themselves a drink. So that's kind of cool. Uh, again, there's no booklet, but let us take a look now at the vinyl. If, there we go. And there's side A, there's the label. And if you haven't guessed by now, you can see that this is going to be on, I think it was exclusive to the New West website. Oh, my word. She's staticky. Look at that. And these are all so unique. I've seen so many pictures online from my Wild Feathers fan groups and social media. Look at that, how different that is. That's a unique colored vinyl. That's really pretty. And the, um, again, the, um, the label just says A and B, the Wild Feathers Alvarado, New West Records. And again, let me just give you one more look at that. That's just beautiful. So there you have it, folks. That's the uh, new album by the Wild Feathers. I think they have it also in standard black vinyl. And um, again, you get the CD, New West Records. Just check out the Wild Feathers website. And let me know if you like the Wild Feathers, if you've heard of the Wild Feathers. Um, what records do you have of theirs? Uh, I have all their stuff now. Um, other than they have a live album, which I still don't have yet, Live at the Ryman. So I'd like to find that somewhere. But um, thank you all for watching. Again, thank you all for the support. Um, I'm probably going to have another video or two up here directly. Uh, I've got a few that I want to want to get out there to you all. So thank you all for your patience between videos. And I look forward to you all um, joining me on the next one really, really soon. So cheers.